Greetings, fellow outsiders, and welcome to Project Cat Paper Lily Prologue. This is a unconventional RPG maker game where we guide a protagonist cat as she attempts to uncover the mystery behind a strange golden letter. Let's play. This is peaceful so far. So we're in a garden. Use those to move, okay. All right, we're in the environment. What should we do now? Pick some flowers? Frolic through the gardens? Hmm? Use Z to interact with the environment. Got it. We've successfully moved through the gates. There's a white flower on the ground. Press Z to pick up items. Take flower. Sure. Obtained white flower. Press X to open the menu and see your items. A white flower I found on the grass. It appears to be a lily, I think. A lily, you say? Hmm. The building ahead seems locked somehow. To use an item, stand close to it and select the item from the menu. So we're supposed to put the flower here. A big flower vase. Unlike the others, this one has no flower. Select. The flower sank into the water. What's happening? <gasps> this is less peaceful. Pity. You thought that would work. You should be more careful about the decisions you make. The solution may seem obvious, but... There is always another way. You may not notice it right away, but your actions will have an impact sooner or later. You may not even remember what you did to cause it. Sadly, regret is always the shadow of choice. Also, you know very well this isn't your home. So why would you mess with things that don't belong to you? You're not welcome here. Look, this is the result of your actions. The result of your expectations. Things are not always what they seem. No! What do you think? Does it still look like a flower to you? You're not prepared to deal with the truth, are you? I guess not. I can't stop you from coming here, but if you're foolish enough to cross my path, I'll kill you myself. Such is the way of our world. Is that a nightmare? Whoa, weird dream. Everyone must be gone already. Looks like it's 11, I should get to it. Fun. Project Cat Paper Lily Prologue. Oh no. You moved it! I didn't, I swear. You know I hate this type of thing. This can't possibly be happening. It's spelled die! Oh my, oh no. Stop joking around, this is serious. Uh, we shouldn't have played this. I told you we were gonna get cursed. Oh no, they're playing the Ouija board. <laughs> what was that? Is that a ghost? We summoned a ghost. Oh my gosh, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. You're making too much noise. Oh, it's just cat. What's with the crazy knocking? What was that for? Did that spook you? You're not supposed to be here, you know. I could say the same about you. Why are you here? Actually, say hello to the new member of the Occult Club. I had the wonderful opportunity to meet all of the members yesterday. I don't recall seeing you there. You three are not part of the club, are you? That's funny, I didn't pin you as all people, uh, of all people as the occult type cat. That's because I'm not. Hey, we're doing something here. I'll save you the trouble, the th all three of you moved it. Huh? The planchette from your game, you all moved it. There was no ghost in the room. There's a simple scientific explanation. It's called the ideometer effect. Simply put, just like your body reacts to pain reflexively, it may also react to your ideas and move on its own. It's pretty much uh, bypasses the part of the brain which we use for conscious behavior. It's not all that different from blinking or breathing. The effect is even stronger when a bunch of gullible people who are desperate to believe in ghost stories get together and play. There was an experiment where the players were blindfolded and suddenly the ghost could no longer spell messages. You can try it if you don't believe me. 
In other words, your mysterious answers from beyond are really just your imagination playing tricks on you. Great job killing the mood. You must be fun at parties. Thanks a lot, Kat. Always a pleasure. <laughs> All right, time to search. I should go over my notes to make sure I don't forget anything. Okay, do I have notes? Is it in here? Inventory notes. I put everything I need to remember here. I need three rooms, 12 candors, a lighter, a rune, a tuft of hair, chalk, preparation, sort the desk in each classroom, turn off all the lights and draw curtains in each classroom, draw a path going from the three rooms in the middle room, uh, place one candle on each desk, light the candles and wait at least five minutes. After waiting, burn the tuft of hair with the candles, blow out the candles, close your eyes and count to 100, open your eyes and then, whoa, what, what happened? All right, so I need to search the school for these items first. The rune should be in this room somewhere. Are we doing some sort of a ritual? After having a dream like that one, is that really a good idea? All right. Do, 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 Let's go look at this crow. A stuffed crow. An interesting choice of decoration. Crows can save your game. Save us often since the future is uncertain. All right, I have saved. Time for a dance party. Do, 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 do. A spherical model of the earth red crosses on certain locations. A thick purple book. A spell book? It looks weird. And it also looks fake. Let's look in here, maybe? Cardboard boxes marked with a symbol. They're sealed with tape. The runes my friend mentioned may be in here, but I need a way to open it. Some books and jars are filled with something. Uh, some small plants. Their quiet existence fascinates you. The drawer underneath is empty. A cool breeze flows from the outside. Close the window? Uh, sure. Is that gonna be like a life-altering decision? Suspicious news articles and posters representing magic circles. There's a book entitled The Truth Behind Mermaids Exposed. <laughs> There's a book entitled Magic Circles for Simpletons. There's some chalk here. Take chalk? Uh, wait, yes. Sure, why not? No, I mean to click yes. Yes, obtain chalk. Draw something on the chalkboard? Sure, why not? What should I draw? A flower, a self-portrait, a house, a butt? <laughs> Or don't draw. Uh, as much as I'd like to go with the fourth option, I'm thinking maybe a flower, considering that seems to be important. It's done. Oh, pretty. That was the most pointless thing you've done today. Beautiful. I should have drawn a butt. <laughs> the box for the game the girls were playing. It says Ouija game board to, for two to four players. Get answers from beyond. Warning, we take no responsibility for any adverse effects playing this game could cause to you or your loved ones. Such as disappointment, I presume. Okay, let's talk to these girls now. I bet you think you're so funny. We have other plans for the night anyway. Whatever you say. She's really concentrated on fixing her ribbon. Best not to disturb her. What are you looking at? Jeez, sorry. Can I look at your bag? It's a school bag. There's something shiny inside. Do you need something? Maybe later. A trash can. It seems to be full. Okay, now that we've explored this entire room, let's go out here. A pin board with some important school papers. An unexciting trash can. It reads no running in the hallways. <laughs> While moving holds shift to run. It teaches me how to do that. Okay. Oh, wow. You can run fast. Go cat. All right, let's see. According to my notes, I need to move the desk to the sides in all three classrooms. Then I can draw a path in the middle of each one with chalk. Uh, well, I'll leave the chalk drawing for last. I want to gather everything I need first. Obtained ritual notes drawing. Should I sort the desks? Sure. This should be easy. Push the desks into the green zones to complete the puzzle. Ooh, if there's one thing I love, it's puzzles. This one looks really easy though. I wonder if the other classrooms are gonna be more difficult. Can I push? I can't push two desks at once. That's okay, I can just do this. And then I can do this. And we're done. That was easy. Perfect. Can I draw chalk? Not yet, I presume. Scissors though. Shells for students to place their school bags. There are no bags right now though. There's a pair of scissors here. Take scissors, sure. Tamed scissors. Some geometry books. Um, there's something over here. Some classroom attendance sheets and schedules. A paper slip with rules for students. There's no time for rules right now. Some boring textbooks. Okay. There's some chalk here. Take it. Sure. I already have enough chalk, but the more the merrier. Is there a reason why I would need more chalk? Some books and something and chalk. Take it. Obtain chalk. Why would I need that much chalk? 
That seems like too much chalk. A pinboard with some important school papers. A list of safety regulations. Who needs safety? We need recklessness. Should I sort the desks in the classroom? Sure. Let's get started. Okay, let's do this. Let's try and do this. Smart. I did it! There we go. Perfect. Now let's check the classroom. Trash can, you feel uninclined to dig through it. Eventually there's gonna be something in one of these trash cans. A clean chalkboard. Can I take the chalk? Some broken chalk, take it. Yes, obtained chalk. Some very thick school-related textbooks. And what is this? The teacher's podium. There's useless history book as well. Oh, don't I also have to close these blinds? Uh-oh, the curtains here are missing. According to the ritual instructions, I need to black out all the rooms. But where will I find new curtains? Okay, well, we'll close these anyway. For the time being. Some classrooms, attendance sheets, and schedules. A paper slip with a list of regulations. No one reads these, so why bother? Some boring textbooks. Alright, I'm assuming I don't see anything else interesting here, so let's leave. Anything here? School papers? Okay, let's go in here. Should I sort the desks? Yes, let's do this. Another puzzle! It is done! I'm a genius! Phew! Some books and chalk, take it. Yes! I want all of the chalk. We're collecting every single chalk that we can find. Okay, so other than that, I'm not sure that there's a wooden desk. Can you look in these desks? Is that seriously a thing? There's a red notebook here. Obtain student's notebook. Can I read that? I'm gonna try and read it. Inventory, maybe it'll give us a red notebook, probably forgotten by a student. The color and design are not my style. Looks like a private journal. Look through it. Let's see. It's just math problems and girly doodles all over. This isn't worth my time. Okay. <laughs> so we didn't get any juicy information out of that. That's okay. A boring trash can. What is this? The theater club's room. It's locked. I may be able to find some curtains in there. I wonder if any of the girls are a member of this club. Okay, so we might have to ask them. This leads downstairs and outside of the school. I should be able to find everything I need on this floor. No need to go downstairs. Which means I'm going back to the girls. Oh, girls. Are any of you in the theater? Oh, wait. I didn't check down here, though. It's locked. And leads downstairs. Give up and go home? Oh man, no, let's finish this. Actually, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save because I think there's multiple endings to this. Say, are any of you members of the theater club? Not really. Not really? Not me. Who wants to know? Well, there's a talent agent waiting outside. He's only interested in teenage girls with a passion for role playing though. What is it that you want? I just need to borrow something from your club room. Do you have a key with you? Hmm, fine, you can have it. If you do me a favor first, I'll do you a favor. I'll conveniently forget that, uh, I- to tell the principal that you three broke into the school at night deal. Aren't you trespassing too? So what's a favor you need? Get my notebook. It's in classroom 3C underneath my desk. You mean this one? How did you- Yes, that's the one. Here's a key. I expect it back at some point. Obtain theater club key. Happy to help. Yay! Okay, I'm gonna save really quick. Okay, instead of just leaving, because I think that's gonna be a really short ending to get, I'm gonna continue with this run and then leave for maybe the next run that I do. This is the theater club's room. It's locked, but I have the key now. Uh, I do. It's in my inventory. The door unlocked. I'm in. Some cardboard boxes full of neatly folded costumes. Okay. Anything over here? There's some paint and brushes in the drawer. Soft red curtain. Draw curtain? Yes. Oh, stars! A chalkboard. There's stars drawn on it. Can I steal any more chalk? A soft red curtain. Take them out? Yes. Obtained curtains. Perfect! Some blankets are sprawled all over the floor. A table with a blank sheet, a poster paper, and some colored pencils. There's really no incentive to check out the contents. A rock, a rack with various hats and scarves. And then is this gonna say the same thing? Large pile of cardboard boxes sealed with tape. Can I use the scissors to open these? I wonder, inventory. All right, let's see. I can. There's a ton of useless objects in the box and a letter, read it. Of course. Roses are red, violets are probably violet. My love for you sparkles like the glow from a diamond. I watch you every day, I watch you every night. I watch you, 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 I watch you. 
The other side of the paper is filled with black scribbles. That doesn't sound right. It's not a love letter, that's a stalker letter. There's nothing else of interest in here. Okay, so let's go back. The other thing is we can get a rune, I'm assuming, from the, the room if we use the scissors with the girls. I also have to give her back her key, I think, right? So let me do that. Cardboard box is marked with a symbol. They're sealed with tape. Let me get the key first before I forget. Inventory, key. Are you done with it? Yeah, thanks. I'm surprised you even give it back. Maybe I misjudged you. Well, I guess that's maybe one of the options. Um, okay. Cardboard box is marked with a symbol. I need a way to open this. There. Finally, let's cut this open. There's a bunch of useless trash in here. Aha, this little box may be it. There's three runes, but the ritual doesn't mention a specific one. Which one should I take? The weird O, B, or C? Is this gonna be super important? Um, let's go with the B. Obtained protective rune. That's a good thing, right? Maybe? Crystal ball resting on a cushion. Wow, this cheap plastic exterior really makes it look authentic. <laughs> Okay, so let's go put the curtains back because I think we're actually almost ready. Because um, we have to draw these curtains. We have to use the chalk at some point. Can I just use it here? I have five pieces of chalk, not yet. I'd rather make sure I have everything first. Okay. Okay, I'm putting the curtains up. This should do the trick. Perfect. All right, let me check what I need. Well, I need a tuft of hair for the ritual. Should I cut my own hair? Sure. Uh, here I go, I suppose. Obtained my hair. I never want to do that again. It's just like a mini haircut. You're fine. It's fine. Okay, so then the only other thing, I think that maybe I have everything, because I have the rune, I have the 12 candles, lighter, tuft of hair, and chalk. So should we set up the candles, maybe? I think we're supposed to set up the candles in this room. Okay, I'm using the chalk to draw. Well, my lines aren't perfect, but it should do the job. I need to do this in all three rooms. I'm sure that the school officials are not gonna be mad about you doing this at all. <laughs> all over the floor of three different cl classrooms. Hey, I'm not judging, it's fine. All right, inventory chalk. Good thing I have five pieces of chalk to, to do what I need to do. Two down, one to go. Let's go do it. The last room. Hello? The window is cracked? That spooked me? Maybe we shouldn't be doing this. Maybe the- <gasps> The windows of the classroom? Maybe this is a bad idea. Maybe doing demonic rituals in school is not, is not a good thing. All right, so we have to go back to the other classroom. I'm running. We have to go back here and put the candles in here. Oh, there we go, okay. And over here as well, a wooden desk, inventory. I don't like that the music has stopped either. It makes me f feel really um uneasy. Should I go talk to the girls one more time before we do the ritual? Cause we're like about ready for the ritual. Should we make sure they're okay and there's not like a stalker walking outside? Where'd they go? The girls are gone. Open the window? Huh? I can't seem to open it. Okay, let me save. Can I go into this room now? Is this room open? It's locked. This room is- wait, what is this room anyways? I don't think I've ever seen anybody use it. I'm scared. Oh, that's the crack. All right, let's light. Let's light this candle, baby. Okay, they're lit on one side. And they're lit on that side now. Are we ready? I'm not ready, I'm scared. Everything's ready. All that's left is to wait five minutes and then burn the hair. This is gonna be such a pain to clean up. It really is. Okay, good. We don't have to wait in real time. Seriously, stop messing with these things. But everything I mess with ends up being a scam anyway. What if someday it isn't? What if you end up summoning some ghost or the devil and condemning your soul to an eternity in the netherworld? What if your soul is already damned? 
then I guess that's just what's waiting for me after I die. Cat! It was a joke. You're not gonna find him this way, you know? You just do whatever you want no matter what I say, won't you? It's possible. Stubborn idiot. I prefer ambitious idiot. So, will you tell me where the letter is? You exhaust me, Cat, you know that? And yet, here we are. Fine, you win. It's the occult club. There is a golden envelope uh, in one of the drawers, but they won't let you sniff around since you're not a member. Thanks, you're the best. So I became a member and began sniffing. Huh? Is there somebody at the door? Huh? Go back in. I'm scared. There's a handprint. Do I not have anything to say about the handprint? There's a handprint on the window. Was this always here? No, it wasn't. I don't- ah! Where did you run to? In this classroom? Oh, now I'm scared scared. Now I'm scared scared. There's definitely someone outside the school. Maybe it's the stalker though that we read in the theater room. Okay, even though I'm scared, I'm gonna go back into the one classroom. What do we do now? Do I burn the tuft of hair? What do I do? Light the candles and wait at least five minutes. After waiting, burn the tuft of hair on one of the candles. Blah. Okay, okay, okay. Burn the tuft of hair on one of the candles. Inventory. No! Please, wait. There, tuft of hair. Let's do this. All right, now I just have to blow the candles out. Huh, the candles, did they just? I guess I should count to 100. One, two, three, four, five. 28, 29, 30. Why am I doing this? This ridiculous game couldn't possibly work. 55, 56, 57, 58. I wonder if mom is worried about me. Huh? What was that? 79, 80, 81. What's all that noise? Is anyone there? Oh no, 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 no. 70, or 97, 98, 99, 100. So I open my eyes. Whoa! Whatever you did, it worked. It worked? It worked? It worked! I can't believe it! This is incredible! But where am I? Is it a hallway? It definitely isn't the school. This is unbelievable. How could it have worked? It doesn't make any logical sense. I was in the classroom a minute, a minute ago. Have I gone mad? This is so exciting. I can't believe it worked. <laughs> if I wake up from this and it turns out to be a dream, well, that would be disappointing to say the least. Okay, I definitely need to check this place out. Do you wish to save your progress? Sure. Okay. Whoa, when I move, it looks red. A black substance drips down from above. Whatever it is, it looks disgusting. What is this? Hold up while moving to climb the stairs. A small door with an odd pattern. It's locked. Okay, but what's down here? Looks like guts. A large amount of black substance has accumulated underneath the stairs. This stuff makes me uneasy. What if it comes alive or something? Don't say that. Don't foreshadow that. A door with an odd pattern. It is very locked. A door with an odd pattern, it's locked. Oh, what about this one? A door with an odd pattern, it's locked. Oh, there's eyes underneath! A large amount of black substance has accumulated underneath the stairs. There were eyeballs! A door with a glossy finish, you can see yourself in it. It's locked. More mirrors. The way these mirrors are set on the walls is almost comforting, but staring into mirrors in a place like this, it's almost like I'm asking to be jump scared. Can I get jump scared if I stare into it for long enough? Is that a thing? Okay, I don't think I can be jump scared, which means that we should go up these stairs next, because all these other doors are locked. A black substance drips down from here. Where is this stuff coming from? A fairly normal looking door, but it's locked. Do I have the key to anything? Inventory? I have scissors, ritual notes, drawing? <laughs> Me, something like this. Okay, let's keep going. 
That's strange. Have I already passed through here? Oh yeah, it's a loop. Huh? I have. Hmm. There must be something I missed. Are one of these doors going to be open now? Small door with an odd pattern. But you're not opening it. A door with an odd pattern. A door with an odd pattern. Oh, this is a long hallway. Long hallway. It's never ending. Do I turn around? Is the light flickering? Oh no. Turn around. Um, am I lost? I don't remember this hallway being so long before. What is this? A key? There's a key hanging from a hook. Take key? Yes. Obtained fairly normal looking key. Is that the one at the very top of the high stairs? Door with an odd pattern. That one is the one that's very locked. I think it's this one that I have to go up to. A fairly normal looking door. Okay. Inventory. Let's do it. The key fits. Before proceeding through the door, do you wish to save your pro- Sure. Huh? What's this? Am I back at school already? A paper slip with some rules and regulations. No running in the hallways. No screaming during recess. No escaping. Ever. Well, good thing I'm a rule breaker. Good thing I don't listen to those rules. Let's have some fun, shall we? Entertain me for a while, and in return you get nothing. Huh? Who's talking? I don't like this. I don't like how many windows there are! Dang it. Do you ever know where you are? You choose a one-way trip to heck, kid. Where are you? Well, if you're not gonna help, then be quiet. I'll leave once I find what I came for. Can I go the other way? The door is stuck and won't open. Of course it is. Is there gonna be another scary thing in the window? Oh no. Unsealed golden letters scattered across the floor. They seem to be rituals with various titles. The mirror ritual, the ritual of the well, the bus ritual, the three room ritual. This is the one I did. These all come in golden letters. Do they all work? I should look into this when I get home. I hate to say it, but if you get home, you think you can leave? Now that you can prove all these rituals work, you have no way of going back to tell anyone. The knowledge will die with you. That's all a lie, right? You're just trying to scare me. Maybe. But did you really know what you were messing with? Oh no. Are you lost? I hate backtracking. The hallway is moved now. This is not good. You should give up. You will never leave this place. This is really, 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 really not good. Oh no. The figures stare at you from the other side of the windows. Okay, bye guys. Thanks for inviting me to the party. Your mother will be devastated to learn she's now completely alone. No husband, no daughter. Everybody left her. How pitiful. How dare you say something like that? You know nothing about me. You couldn't tell your father goodbye back then, and now you won't get to tell your mother goodbye either. What if I told you that someone you know is here with you? Would that make you hopeful, relieved? Depends on who it is that I know. I know you're thinking you can escape with them, but these rituals have no way back. They were never designed that way. Well, what if I break the mold? After all, why would you give your prey an escape? I'm scared. There's a lot of hands now. These figures are bunched up against the glass. Stop, 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 stop! The glass seems to be giving out. Cat, I know more about you than you think. Let me show you something. Oh no. Huh? This is... A painting of a vague memory. Trash can filled with blank pieces of paper. A pile of science books. <gasps> Stop! What the heck? A piece of science books. Many of the pages are numbered. Some books on psychological changes in humans in specific environments. There's also a notebook filled with rough scribbles and notes. 
Val of Souls from something below the follow instructions envelope. It's too hazy to read. So was our father messing around with the occult? A pile of anatomy textbooks, bookshelf towers over your small figure, books on out-of-body experiences, a pile of books, the top one is called Depictions of Psychological Trauma in Research Patients. The bookshelf always had felt too large for comfort. Uh-oh. Just what is this place? <gasps> They're gone! Peekaboo! I see you! So what do you think? I can see everything that's in your head. You really should make an effort to be more lively. You only have until I decide that I'm done playing around with you, you know? And then, snap. What are you gonna do? <gasps> Stop! Oh my god. Do I have to run from it? Kind of feels like I'm running towards it a little bit. Is that the monster? Or is that another soul that's trapped here, though, is my other question. Where am I? <gasps> Stop! How would you like to stay trapped here until you die? I wouldn't like that very much, sir. Please let me out. Please, sir. Oh no, we messed around where we shouldn't have. Maybe now you'll reflect on the stupidity of your actions. In the meantime, I'll just watch you right away. Shut up, that's enough. Whoever you are, get out of my head. My life is my business. My decisions are mine alone. Let me out of this place. I know there's a way out there has to be. Please. I want to go home. That's more like it. Wait, I have an escape? This is not- oh, I'm back in this hallway? I don't like this, I need to get out of here. How do you get out of here? How? A door with an odd pattern. A door with an odd pattern. <gasps> an open door. This door is open. Wasn't it boarded up? Boarded up? Everything else is locked. I have no other choice but to go in. Oh no. Blood. 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 A beheaded corpse? That can't be. How is this possible? I just saw her a while ago. I don't understand. Were they messing around with it? A bloody corpse. Oh no, 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 no. Oh my god. This can't be real. It's not real, right? Oh my god. A bloodied corpse. The lower half is missing. Hi. This is my fault. Oh no. Oh no, I don't trust this. A welcoming door. It's locked. I have to. Get out. A welcoming door, it's locked. The door. I can leave? I can go home? That didn't sound like not dying. That didn't sound like living. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. So there's multiple endings to this. I wonder which one is the true ending. Cause in that one we finished the ritual and everything. We didn't leave and go home or, or, or anything. Paper pro or Project Cat, Paper Lily Prologue. Thank you for, uh, oh, true end, K1, Curiosity Killed the Cat. Oh no. So Cat is no longer with us. Aw. 
<laughs> okay, well, let's go back and try and get some of the other endings. Okay, I actually started a new game because I was curious what would happen if we did the correct thing in this opening sequence. There's a white flower on the ground. Press C to pick up items. No, 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 you're a pretty little bird and I'm not going to touch you. So let's see. The building ahead seems locked somehow. To use an item, stand close and select the item from the menu. Can I take one of these flowers? No. A big flower vase, unlike the others, this one has no flower. Big flower vase with a white flower in it. Big flower vase with a white flower. And flower vase with a white flower. Door with four colored lights, it's locked. <laughs> Big flower vase with white flowers in it. Take out the flower, yes. Big flower vase with a white flower in it. Are these all birds? Take out the flower, yes. Big flower vase with a white flower. Take out the flower, yes, please. The green light turned red. Put the flower back in. No, 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 no. The door with four colored lights. Oh, the door opened. Fascinating. You've done the opposite of what I expected. A delightful surprise. How did you know, I wonder? Perhaps you're different. Or perhaps you cheated? How odd. Regardless, I advise you not to mess with things that don't belong to you. It's not safe for you. As you already know, in this place, things are not always what they seem. The answers you're looking for are not yours to take. You're not ready to learn the truth. And the truth is not willing to be learned by you. I can't stop you from coming. Just know that if you do, you will be killed. Such is the way of our world. Hmm. Okay, so that's what happens that time. Whoa, weird dream. Everyone must be gone already. Looks like it's 11. I should get to it. Project Cat Paper Lily Prologue. All right, let's try and get a different ending this time. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to do is try and just leave. This leads downstairs and outside of the school. I should be able to find everything. No need to go downstairs. Give up and go home? Yes, this is scary. That night, I got gold feet, I guess. I went home without completing the ritual. Despite that, I made plans to try again. However, both my notes and the letter had disappeared without a trace. I tried telling myself that maybe the ritual was a scam anyways, but how... How will I ever know? Dead end K2, cold cat feet. All right. Well, that is our second ending. There's some chalk here, take chalk. Yes, obtain chalk. Draw something on the chalkboard. Of course, we're drawing a butt. It's done. Wow. That was the most pointless thing you've done today. I would say that's anything but pointless. Better read my notes to make sure I'm not forgetting anything. This is my desk. I keep all kinds of cool stuff here. This might be useful. Take dusty hairpin. Okay. Obtained a dusty hairpin. Can we use that to pick a lock or something? A wooden desk. I'm checking everything now just in case. I'm gonna try and pick the lock here. This room is, what is this room anyways? I don't think I've ever seen anybody use it. I'm really curious as to what's behind this door, but I don't have time for this. You don't have time for this, but I have time for curiosity. Fulfill my curiosity. I've gotta get in somehow, should I try and pick the lock? Okay, so I can pick the lock here, let's give it a shot. Press Z when it matches, oh. Whoops. Whoops. Okay, I did it once. I did it twice. No! Well, that didn't go as planned. Wait, just open it. I did it! The door unlocked, yay! Okay, whoa, wait, that's different. Softer curtain, draw the curtain, yes. A chalkboard, there's something drawn on it? Where did they find the red chalk? Um, I don't know that that's red chalk. That is creepy. That is different. Softer curtain, take them out. Yes. I wonder if that's different because we picked the lock. Obtain curtains. Chalkboard. Cool. All right. <laughs> Let's go, cat. Okay, so this time I'm leaving in, in the middle of the ritual. This leads downstairs. I am a little creeped out, but I'm going to finish what I start. No, you're not. I'm telling you to leave. So we're leaving. Oh, so we got the school stairs. Oops, I went up, go down. Are the school stairs gonna be never ending? How many floors did the school have? What's going on? These stairs are making no sense right now. The building only has three floors. I've taken these stairs every day. 
must be really tired. I'll just go down without thinking. I'm not sure that's a good idea either. Oh no. Are we stuck in like a limbo? I can't get anywhere. Am I dreaming right now? I think I'll just rest here. Tomorrow morning, someone will wake me up, hopefully at home in my own bed. The next time I woke up, I was still in the same place. I tried again, going up, going down, it made no difference. I decided to make an experiment with chalk. Logic would dictate that this X isn't here if I go up or down a floor. Wait, so it's the same place? I'm trapped. So she's just in the same stairwell. I don't think I'm gonna make it home tonight either. Sorry, mom. Dead end K3, academic spiral. So there's our third end. Okay, so what I'm gonna try and do is, now I'm gonna be friendly with the girls and see if I can get more endings that way because I think we still have, there's eight endings total from what I've seen. And we still have five more to get. So let's see what options take us where. Get my notebook, it's in classroom 3C underneath my desk. Should I get the notebook for her? I'll do it. You will? Then why don't you find it please? Go, don't look through it, sure. It was just like math problems and doodles anyway. I looked through it in another playthrough. <laughs> there you go. Is this your notebook? Yeah, that's it. Hope you didn't look through it. Nope, your secrets are safe. All right, here's the key. Bring it back when you're done with it. Obtained theater club key, thank you. An expensive looking radio, turn it on. Oh, sure. What are you even doing? Just looking around. Hello? So what are you doing here? Visiting the school at night is hardly normal no matter what you're looking for. I could ask you the same question. You already know what we were doing. The keyword were. Truth is, I'm doing the same thing as you girls, but it's spookier than your game. A game? Can we join? I thought you had plans for the night. We can probably spare an hour or two. In any case, it's a one-person ritual, so you can't join me in on it. Figures. She really concentrated on fixing her ribbon. Best not to disturb her. Maybe you don't suck as much as I thought. Oh, thank you so much. If you like this kind of occult stuff, why aren't you in the club? Only nerds join this club. That's not entirely false. <laughs> you didn't bring any other games? Not even a deck of cards? No, not really. We didn't anticipate someone ruining our game. Fair enough. Anything else? So how did you get in here? We got a key from someone. I got a key from someone. She got a key from someone. Couldn't you just have joined the club? Why, is that what you did? Join the club just for the key? This conversation isn't going as planned. What were you looking for earlier? Materials for the ritual. Shouldn't you have gathered them ahead of time? Now that's boring. Do you also do your homework ahead of time? I don't know what to say to that. We will probably go home soon. Okay, so I think that I've exhausted that dialogue at least for right now. Are you done with it? Yeah, thanks. I'm surprised you even give it back. Maybe I misjudged you. Will you at least tell us more about your game? I'll let you know how it went on Monday. If it's anything like the rest I tried, I it won't really do anything. Oh, what's with all this chit chat? Are we suddenly friends or something? She's all right, I guess. But she ruined our night. Sorry about that. Well, all right, fine. She means apology accepted. Nice to meet you then, I'm Kat. We know. I'm Julie, this is Saki, and this is Kaya. Nice to meet you. Hey, good luck with your game. Good, finally make some new friends. Do you um need help with that ribbon? Oh no, I'm just fidgeting. Got it. So you know, you're quite the celebrity among third year students for all the wrong reasons. <laughs> you should hang out in 3C sometimes. Okay, good luck with your game. So is that that? Are we friends now? Are we besties? An empty chair, sit down? Of course, yes. What are you doing? I thought you were busy. I'm just taking a break. Is that so? Are you scared? You're scared, aren't you? Did you come to us for comfort? The only scary thing here is that attitude of yours. She's still upset of you messing up her night, as you can see. It's okay to be scared. Oh, I know. Why don't you just show us your ritual as an apology? I'm kind of interested too. Well, the rules say, oh, come on, you don't actually think it's gonna work, do you? It's just a game, as he said. The rules don't actually matter. I suppose not. Then it's decided, we will tag along with you. Your tasks with entertaining us now. Well, I suppose it can't be helped. Let's go then. Yay! Okay, so we have doo-doo, doo-doo, 
Do -do 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 -do. We have the whole party here. <laughs> Fun. Okay, so this has got to be a whole new slew of endings. The first thing I want to try is this. Inventory, use this. I want to see if I can break in here. This room is, what is this room anyways? I don't think I've ever seen anybody use it. Me neither. Say, why don't we check it out? You want to break into this room? Why not? Can't be any worse than trying a silly ritual. I hope it's safe. We would need a way to open it though. We're counting on you. You can do a cat. I never said, geez, fine. It's so dark. Let's see what's behind this door. Maybe we'll find exam answers. Or dead bodies. Or maybe just it's a supply closet. Yeah. Oh God, oh God, okay. I did it! The door is unlocked. Okay, a large locker that could probably fit a person, but it's locked. Some used brooms. Can I get in here? Um, can I get in here using my my thing? The hairpin doesn't fit into this lock. Okay, understood. Calendar and information sheet for cleaning staff. A cleaning cart. It could be used for some cleaning. Boxes filled with rags and other cleaning supplies. Boxes filled with rags. Trash can, even in a place like this. Why would there be a trash can in a supply closet? Maybe it's a spare? Lots of cleaning supplies. It smells weird. Sealed box. But guess what I have? Scissors. To open it. The box contains various empty notebooks, textbooks, and chalk. Take chalk? Of course I want all the chalk. Do I really need all of this chalk? Yes, you do. <laughs> Lots of school supplies. Lots of cleaning supplies. It smells weird. Some boxes filled with random objects. This is the lost found box. Really? Look, I found my old shoe. A shoe? I lost it years ago. How did you lose only one shoe? It just disappeared. Oh my, my lighter. Obtained old lighter. Don't you already have a lighter? This is my old one. You lost a lighter in the school? No, they confiscated it. Figures, lighters can be dangerous. Only in the wrong hands. And yours aren't. You, should, you shouldn't bring lighters to school. But I did. What are you going to do about it? There's nothing else of interest. Okay. Books and uh, paints line on the shelf. There's a small key on one of the shelves. Take it. Of course. Obtain small key. Books and paint lines on the shelf. Books and paint lines. On okay, so that's that. Okay, I'm thinking the key that we picked up on the other side of this room goes here. The key fits. There's some dusty documents that catch your eye. Read them? Yes. It's a lawsuit? What's that doing in a place like this? I heard about that from my dad. Supposedly someone sued the school because of their daughter's disappearance. Oh, the second year girl, right? I heard something happened, but I don't know the school was involved. I don't know either, but she was last seen at school, so her family was convinced that something happened here and it was covered up. There's definitely an odd history of disappearances in this town. When I graduate, I'm out of here. All right. Well, according to the first inning we got, you ain't going anywhere. But at least we got some story there. Oh, you can turn on the light. Well, that's ominous. A little darkness won't hurt anybody, probably. Uh-oh, it doesn't work. Okay, <laughs> I feel less good about this run now. Can I use the lamp though? A dusty lamp, the bulb is missing. Okay, I think I've looked at everything, so let's leave. Isn't this stuff crow just so cool? Oh no! So you're that type, huh? It was an accident. And what was that supposed to mean anyways? This isn't good. It's okay, you can just apologize next week. Yeah, it's okay. It was probably the only valuable thing in this room anyways. Ah. So I no longer have a save system with the girls. Okay, that's... Mm, that's concerning. Just a little bit. Okay, so there's a couple different things I think we can do here. We can complete the ritual. Oh, I kind of want to see the theater club. What they say about this. Because remember, there was like a stalker note in here. So I'm gonna um, open the box and see what they have to say. All right, let's see. There's a ton of useless objects in the boxes and a letter, read it. Yes. Roses are red, Vi violets are probably violet. My love sparkles you like the glow of a diamond. I watch you every day, I watch you every night. I watch you, 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 I watch you. The other side of the paper is filled with black scribbles. Is everyone in your club okay? Right now, I'm not sure. Creepy. Creepy. As much as the first time we saw that. Oh, perfect. Totally. Nobody will even notice. Okay, so I'm setting up the ritual now with them. 
um, which includes chalk. Not yet, I'd rather make sure I have everything I need for- Oh, I need hair. Okay, inventory, cut hair. Well, I need a tuft of hair for the ritual. Should I cut my own hair? Yes. Uh, here I go, I suppose. Obtained my hair. Never want to do that again. You're so brave, cat. <laughs> Thanks, Kaya. <laughs> All right, now we can use the chalk. Not yet, I want to finish preparing the classroom. Did I not do that already? I thought I did, because I had to get the notebook. Okay, everything is lit. Now what? Now we just wait five minutes, doing nothing. Peace and quiet are not as bad as you imagine. After that, I'll burn the hair and, uh, you help me blow out the candles one by one. Burnt hair smells bad. It does, but it's the last step. Might as well do it right. What happens then? No idea. Really? We probably just clean up and go home. These rituals are a scam, you know? So you're just making a mess so that we can help you clean it up? What's the matter? Are you not entertained? I think it's time. Finally. Now I just burn this. Quickly, put out the candles now. Oh, they're actually manually blowing them out this time. Now shut your eyes and be quiet while I count to 100, okay? Got it. All right, I'll start. One, two, three, four, five. 28, 29, 30. 55, 56, 57, 58. Shh. They're not talking. 78, 80, 81, or 79. <gasps> huh? What the heck was that? 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Oh no. Huh? What the? Who are those? Oh no. Oh no. I'm so sorry. Julie's dismember body. What? This can't be. So there's no way to, way to save them? A school desk? It feels unnatural to the touch like it's made of stone? School desk. School desk. A school desk. A school desk. Kea, uh, Kea's lifeless body. Oh my god, she didn't deserve this. So no matter the ending, school desk, they're just screwed by being here. Saki's headless body. No way, this can't be real. Saki's headless body. A school desk. 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 Can I leave? I'm leaving. You know, despite the rules, every so often some moron thinks they can bring in an entire group. Huh? Who's there? Where is this place? I would have at least made it interesting for you, but now forget it. What? Wait! Dead end K5. Party wipe. Oh no. Okay, so this time we're gonna leave immediately without doing anything. This leads downstairs and outside of the school. What are you doing? Are we done already? Are we going home? Yeah, let's go home. Really? I guess I'll get my stuff. I'm hoping this saves them because we haven't really started the um, thing. And so we went home without completing the ritual. For some reason, I lost interest after that. In exchange, I gained some new people to talk to. Well, I suppose the ritual couldn't have been that important anyways. Dead end K4, never mind forever. <gasps> oh my god, that scared me. They glitched. <laughs> They're glitching. They're not part of the party anymore. I thought there was a monster up there that scared me so bad. They're just so interested in the textbooks over there. This time I'm gonna try and leave mid ritual like I did before. I need to do this in all three rooms. Okay, everybody's back. Um, I'm gonna try and do this mid ritual. So like finish it part way and then leave and see if we get caught in a loop just with these girls now. Oh, we can leave. It's no stairway. Wait a moment. This didn't look right. We should have come across the stairs a while back. That's true. Maybe we took a wrong turn somewhere. Let's just keep going. Oh no, are we stuck with them? Wait, let's go back. Can we go back? I don't think we can. Oh, we can? I want to see what's on the other side of this hallway. Oh, cat. <laughs> You're gonna get everybody murdered. What is this? We're back here? Maybe this is the school's way of saying you can't leave now? How can you say something like that? 
Are we going home soon? Are you kidding me? Can we leave? Oh no, we're in a loop. So we have to go through with something. Can I get into here now? I wonder. Okay, I broke in again. The door unlocked. Is this gonna be any different? Well, that's ominous. Little darkness won't hurt anybody, probably. A large locker that could probably fit a person, it's locked. Oh my god, I just got chills. There's another side of this hallway. Books and there's a small key on one of the shelves. Take it, yes. Books and on the shelves, okay. A locker that could probably fit a person. Is that a hiding spot? Am I gonna have to hide? That's weird. What is it? The existence of this room makes no sense. What do you mean? Based on the shape of the school, this can't be a room. It would be floating in the air when seen from outside. Interesting. But we didn't even finish the ritual. What's happening? I don't know. Isn't it exciting? Let's keep going. A large locker, it's sealed shut. Can I use the key? The locker has no keyhole. Some brand new brooms, a calendar probably. There are no dates or months or names on it. A cleaning cart, it's sparkling clean. It's packed with white chalk and nothing else. This must be like a year's supply. Take all the chalk! They're packed too tightly, I can't pull any out. No! What about the chalk? It's inhumane! Trash can, you can't see the bottom. Box is filled with the broom with cleaning supplies. A lamp, there's no light bulb or slot to place a light bulb in. A large locker, it's sealed shut. Can I put the key again? I'm gonna try it. Locker has no keyhole. Can I use the scissors? No. Okay. Some boxes filled with left shoes and lighters. Oh, creepy. We're like in an alternate universe sort of thing. So maybe the ritual worked? But the ritual wasn't finished, which means either the school is a bunch of cursed looking rooms or a dark secret, or this isn't the school anymore. If it's not the school, then what is it? No idea. In any case, it doesn't feel too dangerous, so let's continue. Famous last words. A large locker. It's locked. Okay, so can I open this one? The key fits. There's some official looking documents here. Read them? Yes. Meeting 176 notes. Disagreements on the distribution of the... It's still not participating in our... The secondary duty of guardians. Collection of stones from every... The document continues making little sense for several pages. What the heck am I reading? Is there an occult? Large locker? There's nothing else of interest. The box contains an assortment of differently sized blue cans. Pile of boxes. They seem to be stuck together. Despite your best efforts, you can't seem to cut through it with your scissors. Can I do the scissors here? They're already open. Trash can? A trash can. Some black goo can be seen at the bottom. Oh my god, look at those trash cans! Pile of trash cans. They seem to be stuck together. Can I use this again? No. All right, we got a ton of lockers, a large locker, it's locked. Okay, so are each of these gonna have different secrets in them? The key fits, but there's nothing inside. The key fits, but there's nothing inside. Large locker. The key fits, but there's nothing inside. There's gonna be something in one of these, a large locker, it's locked. The key fits, but there's nothing inside. Is there gonna be something in this one? The key fits, but there's nothing inside. Okay, let's continue. Very weird. Oh no. Large pile of trash cans, they all seem to be empty. Large pile of boxes, it goes all the way to the ceiling. <gasps> that scared me. This room feels different. Yes, it's longer. Is it safe? Ah, oh, there you are. Who are you? What is this place? Straight to the point, I see. Well, this isn't quite your world. What? Let's not get into it. You're doing a ritual, correct? Stop and go home. All of you, I mean it. Excuse me? Cat, if you keep doing what you're doing, things won't end well. Do you know this person, Cat? Not at all. They seem to know you, though. What is it with everyone warning me lately? I need some answers. So far, you haven't- Stop. Don't cross that line. If you haven't realized by now, the, the ritual works. It will take you somewhere you'll never return from. If it works, then I should definitely finish it. Cat, what are you saying? Sorry, but I can't listen to this person. I have reasons for doing this. 
I don't know how much you value what you have right now, but if you continue down this path, you'll lose everything. Everything you hold dear and everything you don't. Your questions will not receive any satisfying answers, and everything you know about the world will turn meaningless. Those three. Are you willing to sacrifice their lives for your so-called reasons? Lives? Furthermore, your own life? Are you willing to die for the answers you're seeking? Let's go back, Cat. I want to leave. I don't believe you. Why don't you just give me my answers yourself then? Spare me the trip. I thought so. I've said what I needed to. Why? Who are you? Just someone who has seen too many humans die. It would sadden me to add your life. Add you four to the pile. Go home, Cat. Can't you feel it in the air here? You're all in danger. Cat, please, this feels too dangerous. Cat, let's just go. Yeah, let's get out of here. I didn't sign up for this. Cat, we don't. Something bad happened to you. Fine, let's go. Are you by any chance some person from my dream earlier today? A dream? It must have been your subconscious warning you as well. I see. I'll pass on the ritual for tonight. That's good enough. Ooh. And so we left the school and walked home. No one said anything for a while. Aw, cute! I think the cat is feeling down. Yeah. Should we do something? What's on your mind? I don't know. Do you think that cat likes to sing? Hmm? Good idea, Saki. Haven't you seen... Uh, haven't seen you this excited about karaoke before, Kaya. That's a yes, then? All right. So... We were thinking of going to this place. I can't do this. She's ignoring me. Cat! Hmm? Come with us. Hmm? Just come. Sure, whatever. You're so good! <laughs> oh, do we have new best friends? Are they trying to cheer me up? Cat, go with them. It's better than the alternative. Believe me, I've seen it. Maybe things are better this way. I need to believe that much, at least. Dead end, K7. Girls night out. Aww! I like that. That was my favorite end so far, in terms of, like, goodness. <laughs> Okay, so this time we're snipping the plants for some reason? Oh no. What are you doing? Is this part of the ritual? No, I'm just a horrible person. You didn't think that? Is there a plant in here? Give me all the plants. I'm a plant murderer. <laughs> Happy green plant. Um, what's wrong with you? If this ritual involves mass genocide of harmless plants, I want nothing to do with it. Agreed. Are they gonna get mad at me and leave? All right, I think there's a plant in here too, yeah. Happy green plant. Snip, snip. Are you seriously going to go around killing all these plants? I knew you were a psychopath. Sorry, Cat, but we didn't sign up for this. I don't like this ritual anymore. Don't worry, Kaya, we're going home now. Don't talk to us again. Sorry. <laughs> Once they were gone, I felt a bit, bit guilty, so I went home as well. Maybe I'll try the ritual again some other time. Next time, I hope not to run into anyone. Dead end K6. Snip, snip, snip. Okay. <laughs> that was the most random ending. Um, I think there's one more that I haven't gotten, so let's try and get it. <gasps> I did it! Whoa! The door unlocked. Before proceeding through the door, do you wish to save your progress? Sure, why not? Huh? What's this? Am I back in the school already? Okay, so then we have the nightmare sequence, which I'm assuming is going to be the same. Not interested, huh? You really should make an effort to be more lively. You only have until I decide I'm done playing around with you, you know? And then snap. So that was slightly different. I'm just basically speedrunning it to the end to see if I can make any different... Oh, that scared me again. Any different choices. Maybe now you will reflect on the stupidity of your actions. No, because I don't want to. Ooh, just leave me alone. In the meantime, I'll just watch you right away. Shut up, that's enough. Whoever you are, get out of my head. My life is my business. Please let me out or be strong. Okay, we're being strong. I am not going to give you the reaction you want. I'm better than that. You think you can come here and torture me? 
If entertainment is what you want, then I'll just bore you to death. I hope you have a good book nearby. Have it your way. I didn't hear from the voice again. But no, how, no matter how much I wanted to, I didn't scream for help. Someone will come for me eventually. I just know it. You're in a different dimension, boo. Dead end K8, my way. All right, I think that was all the endings. Um, excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. I went back in because I think there's one more secret I have not, I've yet to get. There is a golden envelope in the drawer. There are instructions for the ritual I'm doing. Thankfully, I shortened them when I wrote them in my notes. Read full ritual rules? Yes, please. You must play alone. Requirements, three dark adjacent rooms, 12 candles, a lighter or matches. A rune, a tuft of human hair, white chalk or white paint preparations. Uh, start after the sun is set. All three rooms must be pitch black. Turn off all the lights, draw the curtains and close the doors using the chalk or paint draw path going through the three rooms. This path will serve to connect your current location to your destination. In the middle room, place six candles on each side of the drawn path parallel to it. Instructions, light each of the candles and burn them for at least five minutes. From this point, you can no longer abort the ritual. After five minutes have passed, burn the tuft of hair on one of the candles. Proceed to blow out all the candles one by one. When the last candle is put out, quickly close your eyes and count to 100. Open your eyes. To remember, you must always close the door behind you. Leaving it open may attract unwanted attention. Do not let the rune out of your possession. It is your only protection. Do not bring any weapons with you. If you arm yourself, so will they. Should anything be heard or felt while you count to 100, it must be ignored. Do not open your eyes. Do not turn on the lights. Do not move. It is normal to feel like you are not alone. You won't be. All right. Well, that got us some more information. Okay. Well, I think on that note, that is going to be... That's another thing. Cat, the windows of the classroom. That is going to be it for me because I think I got all the endings and I think I got at least a good amount of secrets. I've gotten like a lot of the information I think around the environment. So if you guys enjoy this, be sure to leave a like down in the video. It took me a long time to get all the endings. But on that note, I'm going to say farewell, friends. Thank you so much for being here. Remember, we're not alone out there. Remember not to do rituals by yourself in your school after hours. And I will see you in another video. Bye-bye.